Hi, my name is Sai Shankar. I'm the founder and chief engineer at Cybotics, and today I'm really excited to introduce to you the Cybotics Scorpion educational robot. Now, before I tell you how awesome the Scorpion robot is, I'd like to give you a bit of backstory on how and why the Scorpion robot came into existence. So I spent the last 10 years of my career teaching students and training other instructors in STEM-related fields, such as robotics. And time and again, what I found was the equipment used to teach these students and train these instructors really sucked. Almost all the robots available were either toys that were being sold as STEM equipment or were educational robots that really lacked in their functionality. And so when I realized that there really wasn't anything decent out there, I decided to build my own. And that's how the Scorpion came into existence. The Scorpion is a mechanum wheeled robot that has four powerful motors driving each wheel. So other than turning and moving like a regular wheeled robot, it can also move sideways, diagonally, and can even track a perfect curve. This also allows it to do cool things like dribble through cones. Each of these motors has a wheel encoder on them, so you can measure exactly how far each wheel has moved and also how far the robot itself has moved. The robot measures 12 and a half inches long by about nine and a half inches wide by a little under five inches tall and is built on a really solid custom chassis. The robot comes fully factory assembled and ready to go right out of the box so you don't have to waste hours and hours figuring out how to assemble finicky parts. The brains of the Scorpion, its processor, is based on the Arduino ecosystem and allows you to code the robot in C or C++ using the vast array of libraries and resources available in that ecosystem. It also has three high precision ultrasonic sensors. It has one on the front and one on each of its sides so the robot can sense obstacles and navigate through its environment. It also has a precision time of flight sensor right above its gripper arm, which is super helpful for measuring the distance to objects that you might want the robot to pick up. The gripper arm also rotates almost 180 degrees, which is great when you want to make the robot do things like open valves or change the orientation of objects it's holding. Oh, and the time of flight sensor can also be used to navigate when the robot is driving backwards. The Scorpion is also very easy to connect to and code. Plug the provided USB-C cable into the port on the front and then connect the cable to a Windows computer, Mac, or even a Chromebook, and you'll be coding the robot in no time using the Arduino IDE. But the Scorpion isn't just a robot that you have to figure out on your own. Every Scorpion robot comes with access to an online course that walks you step by step through how the robot works and then covers a lot of topics on the fundamentals of robotics. The course has a structured syllabus, video lectures, hands-on exercises, and tests at the end of every module to help learners absorb and understand all this really cool tech. But the Scorpion isn't just designed to be used for the course. Once you get comfortable with the robot and all the basics of robotics, the Scorpion allows you to add more advanced sensors and options to make it do even cooler stuff. Remove the four screws on the Scorpion's top cover and you'll find that it is equipped with additional I.O. ports, I2C ports, 5 volt power rails, and even a serial port to connect it to more advanced sensors and single board computers like the Raspberry Pi. The Scorpion's top cover also has plenty of space to mount additional sensors and boards, and we've even put a pre-drilled hole behind this grommet that allows you to keep all your wiring nice and tidy if you choose to add additional components to your robot. And when you're testing your code, you have a nice big red button to reset and rerun your code whenever you need to. So this also makes the Scorpion a really nice research platform for robotics and AI, in addition to being an awesome educational tool. The robot is powered by seven rechargeable AA batteries, it ships with a charger and two sets of batteries so you can get the robot running right out of the box. Another thing we're really proud of is that the Scorpion was designed, engineered, tested, and will be built right here in the USA at our facility in New Jersey. And we don't just plan to stop with just this one robot. 
we hope to build a whole lineup of really complete educational tools with awesome courses to go with them. Our goal is to really improve the quality of technical education for learners of all ages. So I really hope you'll support this project and help us in taking that first step towards improving the quality of technical education for learners of all ages. Please follow us on social media to keep track of the project's progress. And thanks for checking us out.